What is up, you guys? Realistic Gaming here. Today, we're going to be doing some Roblox scary stories. Oh, God. Oh, my God. We got everybody here, man. What does this shirt say? Chill. All right. You guys got to stay chill, man. All right. So, it is Friday, by the way. So, happy Friday to everybody. Before we start this video, can we get it to 500 likes? That would be awesome, guys. Yeah. Okay, so let's begin with the first story here, SCP-087-B, experience it yourself. Oh god, okay, so let's go see what this is about. Oh my god, it's so dark in here, man. Oh god, okay, so it seems like we're going down into the facility or something. Okay, it's so dark, man, everybody stay together, come on, guys. Uh-oh, you guys hear that? You hear the weird noise of the SCP? Okay, so why are we going more down and down? Oh my god, how deep down is this gonna go? Okay, let's just take a shortcut, jump off the staircase. Can we do this? Oh my god, kids. It's just gonna continue, keep going. Oh my god, okay, so we finally made it to the bottom level and SCP is right here. The SCP-78 or what was it, 87? Oh god, there he is. Dude, what is he doing? Oh no, he just got my boy right there. Okay, so he's like, this is a scary story, you guys. Then there's actually an NPC chasing us. Oh god, run. <laughs> no. Oh my god, keep going. Let's keep going down, man. Oh, I guess this is the end. No, we're stuck here, dude. Oh my god, so we just came all the way down here to encounter this crazy maniac at the bottom. Okay, you can oof me. There you go, man. Oh my god. Dude, I thought that was gonna never end. Okay, so I guess? I mean, that was pretty cool because, like, we never see that in a story where there's an actual NPC chasing you around. Okay, so what's this one? Oh, there's another one over there. Let's go check it out. Oh my god, the stairs, yeah, they were going on forever. What's up, dude? Okay, so let's go into the rake. Oh, we never really see a lot of these stories. Okay, so, uh, Mommy, I'm scared. There's a monster under my bed. Don't be scared, honey. I checked for monsters under your bed. Okay, so it seems like this little boy right here, he's tripping now because he knows the rake is under his bed or he might be outside the window right here. But let's go see what happens next. Um, okay, have a good night. Sleep, Tommy. Okay, mommy. Okay, so there he goes. His mom's leaving him. He's gonna go to sleep, hopefully. I mean, he might be haunted. Oh my god, and the rake is under there. Okay, so he's right now he's deeply asleep and he has no clue that the rake is right under his bed. <laughs> oh my god, that's so scary, man. Okay, quick, there was a scream coming from Tommy's room. What? Okay, so oh my god, so something happened to Tommy. They heard a scream from his room and the mom and dad are racing over to his bedroom right now. Oh my god, Tommy! Where are you, Tommy? Oh, dude. Okay, so it seems like the rake took Tommy out of here. The window's broken and everything. And the bed's upside down, so this is not good. It's not looking good for Tommy. F for Tommy in the chat. What? Dude, we just fell. We just fell off the map. Oh my god, that guy didn't... Did he not complete the story? Well, I guess that was the end of the story, actually. What? <laughs> okay, so I guess he didn't want to finish the story and he just ended the the game right there. Okay, whatever, man. Okay, so let's go to SCP-173 Containment Breach. Okay, so, oh my god. So, that's it? It's just a statue? Huh? Okay, so little do these guys not know that this little potato-looking guy here is so deadly. But the, the one thing is that you if you blink, he will get you. So, let's make sure you don't blink. What does he do? Stop. We don't know what it does. Okay, so this guy's like, dude, let's just go see what's up with this thing right here. It's just in the corner. But this guy's like, bro, you have to relax. We don't know what this thing even is. I mean, it doesn't even look like a human to begin with. We were put in here for a reason. What are you? Oh, God, look at him. He's, he's so scared. But this guy's like, he's angry about it. I don't know why he would be like so bothered about it, man. He's just minding his business there in the corner. Blinks. Uh-oh. Okay, he just made a horrible mistake, you guys. He blinked right in front of the SCP. Oh, my God. What the? Oh, he snapped his neck. Oh, God. Well, rest in peace to this guy. I don't know what his name was. Let's just call him Jerry. The Let's just call him Jerry, for God's sake. Okay, so. Uh, keep your eyes on it. Don't turn or blink. That thing just killed him. You are right, man. Do not blink or turn around or he will get you. Oh god, I need a blink. I'll keep looking. You blink. Oh no. Okay, so the other guy's about to blink right now. And little does he know he's gonna join his his prison mate. Oh god, okay, so what happened? Okay, oh, the speaker. Maintain direct, direct eye contact. Do not look away. Oh god, sound the alarm. Okay, so they just found out that he killed the inmate. 
Wow, that was like 10 seconds later. Oh! Oh my god, so we got the light flashing and everything in here? That's pretty awesome. Keep looking! Okay! Oh my god, they're trying so hard not to blink. Okay, the sign is having multiple Keter and, and Euclid containment breaches. Full site lockdown on. Uh oh, they're on full lockdown because of the SCP. <laughs> uh oh, blinks. No! He blinked! Oh no, rest in peace to him, man. Yep, and there he goes. Oh god. Oh my god, this guy's the last man standing in here. He's holding it down. He's a real one, man. Okay, no, 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 no. Blinks. Uh oh. And there goes the last one, man. He tried his hardest not to blink, but he couldn't resist. Uh oh, the SCP's running at him. Oh my god, that is so scary. What? He blinked again. Uh oh, he's not doing anything to him, though. The T. Oh. I spoke too soon, he is gone. <laughs> oh no, rest in peace. I mean, he tried his best not to blink, you know? I mean, it's pretty hard trying not to blink, trying to go for like a whole straight minute. I don't even know how long I can even go without blinking, but I don't want to try it right now, so let's go check out to the next story. Where's the bird? What bird? There was no bird in there, man. Okay, so we got another, oh, we got a Slenderman story here. Should be cool. Okay, I probably shouldn't go out tonight, especially because of those missing children. Oh god, it's okay, so it seems like there has been some missing children on the news or something that he heard about. So he doesn't want to go out and about. Okay, uh, what the? Uh oh. His TV went static mode on him. Uh oh, something fishy is about to happen, you guys. Okay, so what the? Okay, he's slipping. The oh, Slenderman popped out on his TV. What? How is that even possible? Where does he even live? He lives like in the forest in the middle of nowhere. Look at this. <laughs> Call 911. Boy, you better run for your life instead of calling for 911. That's what I would have done. Okay, it says, oh God, it turns on the phone light. Okay. okay, so it seems like the electricity or the power went out in his house. And he, he only has his flashlight on the phone. Hello? Uh oh, okay, so it's supposed to be like pitch black in here. And he's freaking out, man. Oh God, no. Oh, Slender Man got him. Oh no, look at his face! Oh god, that is one funny face, I've never seen that before. Slender Man needs some milk! Oh god, okay, so I guess that's it. Slender Man took that boy. He took him out of here. Okay, so let's reset and go back to the lobby. Hey, hey, nice shirt, man. Hey, he has like Goku hair. That's pretty cool. Okay, so let's go on over here. This place is pretty awesome. Oh, I, by the way, this is called the Scary Stories Mansion or something like that. I'll put the link for you guys in the description or in the comments. Okay, so, oh, okay, so we did Slenderman. We got the train. What? Okay, so it's a scary story on a train. Okay, so it seems like we're in a train track. We're at a station, but there's no train anywhere. Do you guys see a train anywhere? No? Okay, he said no, so there's no train here. If you type this slender man need milk, can you see this slender man need milk? Oh! Okay, so there's a train. Wait, is it a train? It just looks like a, like a light, just, just right there, you know, on the wall. Oh god, yeah, that was pretty loud too. Okay, so there's no train. Oh, there it is. Okay, so there's a train. So what's up with this train? What's so special about it, huh? It's just a random train at a random stop at a random time just being a train. It's a, it's a dank agent. That's not Thomas the dank engine, man. Oh, God. Oh, what? Is it like a ghost train? I think it's like a ghost train, you guys. Oh, no. Wait. Okay. But he's walking on it. So, I don't know. But it seems like it is like definitely a ghost train to me. So, if you guys know anything about this, let me know, man. What? It just disappeared. So I guess it really was the ghost train because it just vanished out of nowhere. And there's only smoke left. Like the mist of clouds just leaving a little scary, eerie, like, you know, feeling. Oh god, alright man, so let's- Oh, 1974! So it was a ghost train the whole time, so it seems like back in 1974 this train might have, like, crashed. And then, like, I guess everybody oofed in there, so I guess it became like a ghost train or something, man. Rest in peace, train! Oh my god, he will be remembered by <gasps> Thomas the Train and his fellow relatives or friends. Oh my god. So I think there is another story. I'm not sure, but let's go see. Let's just go see. 1974, yeah, man. That is a long time from now. That's about like, what, 1974, 2000? That's about 40, 50 years? No, that's a long time. Oh, God. Okay, oh, 
I think we got something over here. Okay, so it says coming soon. Oh god, so we just walked all the way over here for nothing. Oh, more stories coming soon. Well, I can't wait for these stories to come soon. But I wonder how soon he means by coming soon, man. Alright, you guys. Well, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for the amazing support. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to slap the like button. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe and turn that notification bell on. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.